It is time for the new game. Um. Hmm. I should have a good grasp of the riposte system. Hmm. I'm trying to think of games like this. Uh, I think it's like first person or third person kind of tactical 3D combat with pausing. And... We'll try out hard. Maybe, maybe I can reduce it later on. Maybe. Could you stand a little taller, just a tad? Like this? Yes, yes. The chin a tiny bit lower. Gaze a little more to the right. There, now, hold the pose. Alrighty. This brother man actually don't look half bad. Don't actually look half bad. the afro i know it's here it is not here holy cow none of this hair fits this man so what's going on here my shadows are not looking good right there uh facial hair Doesn't look too bad. Doesn't look too bad either. Doesn't quite fit though. I want this man to be rocking the full beard. Or does this look pretty good? Just don't know. I, I kind of wish there wasn't like this gargantuan shine in his face so I can actually see the full depth of everything. I think we'll rock that. Eyebrows. I'm partial to the bushy eyebrows because I have big bushy eyebrows. All right, we gonna make him, I guess, as dark as he can be because that is not dark at all. <laughs> Hair color. Oh, why it resets like that? I don't see, wait, does it actually reset? That's like blonde, like less, a little bit less blonde. That's like a uh, yellow and then gray. All right. Uh, I'd love to be able to get rid of this or at least move it somewhere else. You know, you ever see a black man with like these green eyes, you know they're dangerous. 
I have never met a black man with green eyes that I thought, uh, and and came out of that conversation with, I got to watch out for this guy. Or not need to not watch. I, Y'all know what I mean. Watch out for black men with green eyes. Okay. Pick a class. Uh, pick your starting skills according to your play style. The skill tree is open. You will be able to unlock the skills of other archetypes as you progress. Well, I can be a mage. Be a technical. <laughs> Uh, focuses on controlling the battlefield. I can set traps, firearms, one-headed blades. Mages are divine magic ring, stasis, one-hand heavy weapons. Could be a warrior. Focus on melee combat. That apparently can use firearms as well. Endurance and strength. Craftsmanship and vigor. Accuracy, agility, science, lockpicking. I do like me some lockpicking. Uh, mental power, willpower, science, intuition. Um, I tend to like mages in these types of games. And I find myself underwhelmed by mages in these types of games all the time. Just a little too squishy and not enough movement options. I feel like being a warrior would be really nice. Um, I guess I need to consider, I, I know there's party members in this game, but I don't know how many party members there are. So I need to consider, are there any classes I would not want to double up on? And I think that's the rogue, but at the same time. Maybe I can get some um, early advantage to being a rogue or a technical I mean, lock picking. I think I'm going to go with technical. Maybe we need to look at the skill tree to to see where this goes. Speaking of intros, uh, you watched the opener for our Wargroove co-op. We nailed that intro 100. It was a pretty good intro. I'm glad I asked you to do the intro because it, uh, it, was, it was making me feel good. Make me feel good. And hello, Mana Dryad. Welcome to Zeus. Okay, this is um, this is interesting. I don't know if this is if these are all just static. Oh, these are these are attributes. Hmm. Hmm. I'm a little sad we didn't play over the weekend, though, uh, Dante. I'm a little sad about that. Because now we only got four days. The knockout was the eight missions? Something like that? I don't think it's going to happen. Seven missions. Okay, so I don't think we're gonna be messing around with spells at all. But I think we're fine on on spells. Uh, agility seems to be where I want to be right now. But uh, strength increases the power of all melee attacks. Oh, this increases physical damage too. Okay. 100 life points is pretty nuts. Alrighty, here we go. Uh, choose the talent in which you invest your starting point to progress in your way, own way as you complete the quests and explore the world. So intuition, gathering sites become easier to see, slightly increased number of ingredients and objects obtained through gathering and looting. Unlock contextual dialogue options. 
Oh boy. All right, lock picking. Let's do pick simple locks. Enemy traps are easier to see. Science allows you to make simple potions, allows you to destroy weak walls with the help of explosive uh, files. Slightly reducing, reduces merchants' prices and slightly improves your companion's combat abilities. Slightly increases the chance of success of some dialogue choices. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, lets you pass through certain difficult passages that require balance. Why is that in vigor? Uh, increases the maximum ammo capacity and lets you recover HP and magic outside of combat. Allows you to craft basic weapons and armor upgrades. You know, y yikes, all right? I want all of these. <laughs> Just like Mana, Mana uh, Dryad says, I always want to do all the things. And I feel like all of these are actually useful. Locks all the contextual dialogue options. Enemy traps are no longer sprung when you pass over them. Wow. Allows you to craft bullets and alchemical preparation. Fewer ingredients. Further increases the chance. Significantly increases. Um. Craft advanced weapon and armor upgrades allows you to recycle pieces of equipment to create ingredients even without a crafting table. Wow. Increases the number of ingredients obtained through recycling. Wow. And if not in a single person, then at least give me several people to control. Yeah, I this this game does have a party system. I don't know how that party system works, and I don't know if I can level them up the way I want to. But I feel like if it's this type of game, I should be able to. Our next one is not until level 5, so we're not going to be getting talent points very quickly, assuming I'm level 1. And I believe this said, I yeah, I get one at level 4. Um, I kind of want to go lock picking. That's the sole reason I picked uh, this side, I guess. But again, I, I kind of want everything. <laughs> 